and the singer of pop band Kajagoogoo is headlining 80s night. Seems to be a massive revival at the moment. Um, especially for someone like our, ourselves. Uh, I mean, our clientele not only actually grew up in the 80s, but some of the young ones were born in the 80s, so the first songs they heard uh, were stuff like sort of uh, Spandau Ballet and uh, Duran Duran and Our Hearts. Now all Mark has to do is find Lamar. While Mark searches for his celebrity guest, the former teen heartthrob is patiently signing autographs outside. Woo. Mark finally makes use of the wonders of modern communication. Lamal, where are you? Whereabouts are you? Ah, oh, right, outside. I'm on my way outside. I'm inside looking for you now. We're two gorgeous blondes. I shall find you straight away then. Leave me with it. Hi. Hi. How are nice you doing, Mark? Very good. Nice Despite a terrible journey, Lamal is clearly delighted to be here for the show. Yeah, it's a cool job. I love my life. I love my life. Especially now as it's the 80s revival, OK? All clubs out there start an 80s night. And he's off to his hotel to relax in the sun and prepare for the show in two days' time. See you later. Down at Oasis Radio, Lamal's here to promote 80s night. DJs Nathan and Paul are hosting the show. Hi, Paul. How are you? Craig and American woman. Now, we've been joined. We've been joined with... We're not worthy. On your knees. We're not worthy. On your knees. <laughs> Oh, stop it. I won't be able to get my head out the door. We've been joined in the studio by 80s legend, 80s idol, icon, and any other word beginning with I and with an O in it that we, we can think of. Iglo. <laughs> <laughs> the, the, the former lead singer of Kajigoogoo and a man with a, with a solo career of all of his own and probably some of the world's most fantastic haircuts in hip-hop history, Lamal. Welcome to Oasis. Hey, hey. Oh, hey. Woo! <laughs> Mal's in the house. Woo, 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 woo. Go on, play, then. It's not going to play at all. Go on, play. Okay. There's a technical hitch, but Lamal comes to the rescue. The this has happened live before. Yeah, it's all right. Turn around. Hey! Look at what you see. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Woo -woo -woo. Now, now let's have it in the pre recorded, not quite as exciting state. Let's have the right songs that have been put on. Oh my god. Well, you got worried then because you, know you didn't you even just... know your own song. <laughs> <laughs> right, I'm well, to I suddenly turned into Dion Warwick. <laughs> <laughs> so what, what can people expect from you tomorrow? What, what are we looking forward to? Well, the great thing about a live performance is it's a one-off. Yeah. You know, no live performance is the same, so that's the first thing. Um, unlike Millie Vanilli, of course I can prove that I did sing on my records. Oh, oh. oh. <laughs> I've really rediscovered myself. I've got all this fab enthusiasm. I've been out shopping and I've got a fab new outfit that I'm wearing tomorrow night. Cheers, hey guys, I'm thank you very it. much. Brilliant. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. We needed two hours, really. Whoa. Hush, hush. good day. Ready to go. The mall's warming up. I have to sing very gently before a show to warm up. It's basically the voice is like a muscle. So before a show, it has to be, it has to, because you know the performance is where you really give it full on, and the and the um, the warm up has to be of a certain, you know, a certain level of intensity. My girls. Darling. Darling. Miggs is Lamar's backing singer, and Sue is a friend along for the ride. Both girls are recruited to help him get dressed and made up for the show. Famous Lamar wig that I will pop on at some point. That's the old, that's the old stuff. Tragic. I need some boots like yours, Mix. I think. Definitely. Ooh. Girls, yeah. what do we think? It looks totally crazy, it's great. <laughs> <laughs> Is this a laugh of approval or a laugh of, oh well, my god? Ready now. Yeah, we're ready now. You're ready now. 
You ready now? Showtime. Do re mi fa so la ti. Oh, <laughs> that's the note I was looking for. At the medieval castle on the outskirts of town, Lamal's gearing up for his performance. Five minutes. Oh my God. Should be okay. This is the time. This is the time to show when my adrenaline really starts to. Woo! Coming up, coming up. It's like a drug, actually. It's like a drug. It's fabulous. Yeah. Always. It's showtime. Oh my God! Here we go. Showtime, baby. Let's go back in time. Mad holiday crowd, they're really up for it. They're here to escape you know, from the trials and tribulations of life. You know, so I mean from a performer's point of view, you can't you can't really lose unless you're really shit. Two hours later, and Lamal joins the fans to party on. Tomo hit bonk.